excellent. So in today's, in today's gospel reading, we read about Jesus, and we read about his disciples, and we read about some people called Pharisees. They were people that studied the Bible a lot. But you know who, one of the pe- who, who some of the people were that were the most important people in that story? You know who they were? Yes, little kids, like you guys. Children came, and the disciples, they didn't like it. That's like, exactly, it's like a baby of Jesus. And they all came because they wanted to see Jesus. And the disciples didn't like it. Yeah, but see, you know who liked it? Jesus liked it. Jesus liked that the little kids were there. It, it, no, I think that's sort of grown-up Jesus, but it's, it's grown-up Jesus. It's just a little grown-up Jesus. That's the thing. Because Jesus says that whether we're big or we're little, we're important, we matter. And no matter who we are, we matter. Sometimes the disciples, they were caught up in who was, more, who, was, who was important enough to be there. They thought they were important enough to be there. They thought maybe some of the other people were important enough to be there, but they didn't think the kids were important enough. And Jesus said everybody matters to God. The little kids and the big kids and the adults and the people who look like they belong and the people who look like they didn't belong, all of those people matter to Jesus. So one of the stories about kids is to remember that everybody matters to Jesus. And if everybody matters to Jesus, then we should treat everybody like they matter. Right? That's the thing. All right, can we say a prayer? Let's pray. Dear Jesus, dear Jesus, thank you that we matter to you. Thank you that we matter to you. Help us to remember, help us to remember that everybody matters, that everybody matters, and to treat others, and to treat others as people you love, as people you love. Amen.